Are you struggling getting the ball out of the bunker? Even something as low as this lip. It doesn't even have to be a high lip. Something really low like that. Do you struggle with it? If you're saying yes, Tiff, I am, or don't go anywhere, I'm going to show you how we can fix that. Hey there, Tiff the Lady Golf Teacher, and welcome to today's tip. We're heading into spring, how cool is that? Anyway, struggling getting the ball out of the bunker. You know, this isn't a very big lip, is it? It's quite small in comparison to some. Yet, I know a lot of people that actually struggle getting the ball out of the bunker with that size lip. Do you struggle? So if you're saying, yes, Tiff, I do struggle, then stay tuned for this. What I see, I'm going to show you from the back here of what, I'm actually, what I actually see. Now, when somebody does their bunker shot, what they tend to do is they'll come through and they'll try and hit and they'll try and do something. As you can see here, I'm pulling around. Okay, so you can see my elbow over there. You can see my clubs come around my body and most likely the ball's probably ended up into the lip somewhere here or it's rolled back down. What we want to do is we want to do this, okay? Now this is really good if you actually went out with a friend and you could do this, but you get set and we don't even worry about a ball yet, okay? There's no ball in this, but what we do is we get set, we go back, we come through, we hit the sand and we come through but notice where the club is. The club's actually still on this side of my body. It hasn't come around the corner, so it hasn't come around my body. It's still staying here nice and straight, okay? That is what you need to be looking for. So you just saw the back view. I'm just gonna quickly show you the front view. So when you come through, you can still see that the arms and the club are still going forward. It's not coming around your body, okay? Your hips are going to do something different. You need to make sure that your hips are working, yes, but you want to make sure that you're coming through, okay? We need the club and the arms to go that way to get the ball to go that way, okay? That's what you got to do. Well, I hope you really enjoyed today's tip. Something really simple to look for in what you need to make sure that you're doing with that club face, okay? The arms, making sure you're going through and everything. So I'd love it if you could leave a comment down below and share with me what you like best about what you heard today or saw. And if you've got friends that you know that would benefit from these videos, I'd love it if you could share them with your friends so that you know that they'll get benefit too. Because remember, we want to build the lady golf teacher community as big as we possibly can. So in the meantime, see it high, let it fly. Have an absolutely awesome day. Look forward to seeing you real soon. Take care. Bye-bye.